One of the coolest things about being a blockchain developer is that there are so many different ways to make money. You're not just limited to getting a job or becoming a freelancer. In fact, there's all these ways that you can earn passive income on the side. I'm personally doing this as a blockchain developer and I'm investing $7,524 into a passive income machine. And in this video, I'm going to show you how I'm doing it, you know, how you can do it and why you have a massive leg up as a blockchain developer. And so before we get into that, if you're new around here, I'm Gregory. And on this channel, I turn you into a blockchain master. So if that's something that you're interested in, then smash the like button down below for the YouTube algorithm and subscribe to the channel. And if you're going to learn how to master blockchain step by step, then head on over to dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp to get started today. All right. Now, one last quick thing before we jump into this. This is not financial advice. This is for educational purposes only. And with that being said, let's jump in. All right. So I've got 12 Ether here and I'm about to purchase 20 more right here for a grand total of 32 Ether. And there we go. So I just bought 32 Ether, which at the time of recording this video is $7,524. So why? So that I can stake it whenever Ethereum 2.0 comes online. Let me explain. So if you're a user of Ethereum right now, maybe you hold some Ethereum cryptocurrency, maybe you're a blockchain developer, then you're using Ethereum 1.0, okay? And pretty soon, Ethereum 2.0 is going to come online. And that's when Ethereum gets ready for prime time to handle like, you know, massive transaction volume a lot faster. And when this happens, there's going to be a really big shift in how the Ethereum network operates, okay? We're not going to have miners anymore. We're going to have validators. And they'll stake their Ethereum cryptocurrency to the blockchain so that they can validate new transactions. And when you stake your Ether, you get a passive income reward for doing this. It's just like mailbox money that automatically gets deposited to your wallet. Okay, so right now you need a minimum of 32 Ether to start staking on Ethereum 2.0. And that's why I just bought it. So one of the big reasons this opportunity is so cool is because you have a huge leg up as a blockchain developer. So let me explain. You know, you need two things in order to do this, right? So the first thing is you need to hold Ether, right? So 32, but you also need to run a node. And this part right here, you know, running an Ethereum node is something that requires technical skills, but that's exactly what I teach on this channel. And, you know, so if you're already a developer, you'll have a huge leg up. And if you're not a developer yet, don't worry. I mean, you could learn enough just to do this. In fact, I'm a huge fan of purpose-driven learning because it gets you excited about what you're learning and you don't learn, you, you only learn what you need to know in order to accomplish this goal. It's just like my flash loan video that I did recently. I think they're so amazing because you can just learn one programming language and do them inside your web browser. And at this point, you might be thinking like, whoa, whoa, you know, I don't have $7,500 to just throw into Ethereum staking, or maybe you do and you just don't want to, right? I totally get that. So there are definitely some alternatives. I'm going to talk to you about those right now. There are platforms out there that allow you to stake your cryptocurrency with less, but of course there's risks involved with these. So always do your own research. And there's also other decentralized protocols that have validators. We saw some great opportunities pop up in the past with Cosmos, for example, or Chainlink. These are decentralized protocols with validators, okay? And there's probably going to be more opportunities that pop up in the future for you to stake cryptocurrency, even if you can't get 32 Ether, all right? So keep watching this channel, subscribe, and you'll be the first to find out when they do. And if you do want to accumulate 32 Ether, there's lots of ways for you to do it as a blockchain developer. You know, you can get a high paying blockchain developer job. You can become a freelancer or you can accumulate Ether, you know, by trading, maybe build your own trading bot. You should check out the video I did recently where I actually show you how to steal my trading bot. All right. So let's talk more about the potential upside. So again, this is not financial advice. This is just what I'm doing for educational purposes only. But you know, Ethereum is the second largest market cap cryptocurrency out there, like $27 billion. And as you move down this list, I mean, most of these cryptocurrencies are less than a 10th of the size of Ethereum. So that's how big the platform is. There's a lot of eyeballs on this. And let's look at the potential staking returns. Okay. So here's a calculator that shows you if you do 32 ether, then it says you have a potential 12% reward. Now this is a little optimistic. It's a little high. The more people do this. And I've heard Vitalik Buterin himself say that the uh, expected staking return is more like two to 6%. Okay. Now this is not massive, but think about it now. Okay. What if the Ethereum price goes up, right? What if it goes up a lot? Right now, Ethereum is about $250, but uh, at its all-time high, you know, it was close to $1,400. And 
then again, this is the second largest market cap cryptocurrency with the most developer adoption. And if you buy 32 Ether now and the price goes up, you're going to get 2 to 6% returns on that much higher number. And what if Ethereum 2.0 actually causes the price of Ether to go up? I mean, think about it. When you have people staking Ethereum, it doesn't circulate, all right? And that's going to basically decrease the circulating supply. And just by a simple supply and demand economics could cause the price to increase. And I'm personally buying into this because I think it could happen. Now, of course, the Ethereum price could go down. So do your own research. Don't get wrecked. But I'm taking a risk to do this. And also for me personally, my downside's limited uh, because I feel a sense of ownership in the network itself. You know, as a blockchain developer, I want Ethereum to succeed. So I want to do my part by, you know, helping maintain the network and staking my cryptocurrency to do it. And also, if you don't want to risk any money and you just want to learn how to set up a validator node, you can do that right now because Ethereum 2.0 already has a test network where you can do this. And here's a complete step-by-step -step technical guide on how to set that up. So I'm not doing any tutorials right now, but if you want to see, you know, more info about this in the future, then leave a comment down below. So yeah, this is really cool because this is on a test network, so you can't lose any real money uh, if something goes wrong. And even if you plan on doing this for real, I highly recommend doing a dry run first on a test network so that you don't mess anything up when you you know actually take 32 Ether and do this for real. So yeah, this is a huge deal. And that's how you get into staking uh, so that you can earn passive income as a blockchain developer. And that's what's so exciting about this space. I mean, there's so many ways to earn money other than just you know getting a job or becoming a freelancer. So if you're not a developer yet, don't worry. Like you could learn exactly for this purpose. And in fact, you can get started today. Uh, just head over to my YouTube homepage. There's, you know, several tutorials there uh, ready to go. You know, just pick one of them and get started. They're basically like Udemy courses, but free. Um, and if you want to take the next step, or maybe you want to take a massive shortcut entirely, uh, then head on over to dappuniversity.com forward slash bootcamp. I can show you how to master blockchain step by step from start to finish, Okay. So yeah, that's all I got. And until next time, thanks for watching DAP University.